The association, according to a member of the Gulf Fishermen Cooperative Society, seeks to recognize the contribution made by females in a sector that is male-dominated. Though still in its formative stage, the project is expected to run for one year and six months. Cecil Marquez is a member of the Gulf Fishermen Cooperative Society Limited. During COVID time, that women played a very, very important part in sustainability, in being involved in the fishing sector, much more than men. The involvement of women has been overlooked. So the idea is to get them form a, a group, a women's group in like in every parish, and then form a national women's fisher folk organization. The Center for Environmental and Resource Management from the University of the West Indies is spearheading the project. Marquez says they are hoping to make this the first national women's fisher folk organization and by extension the first in the OECS. He described females in the industry as experts in the field. The men bring the fish to the shore and the women are the experts. They have developed that skill and honed that skill over the years that they could cut a fish and even maximize the, the amount that could make bigger profits. Okay, the way they slice it, the way they handle it. So they are experts and I don't, I think that they are missing that, that part of it. So we are really trying to create the awareness more so than anything else. Mobilization has begun in Guav and would move throughout the different parishes on island where he says groups will be formed leading to the final formation of the National Association. Chrislina John, GBN News.